Welcome YouTube fam, if you like visiting and learning about castles, this video is for you. Meiji Castle dates back to the 14th century. The castle played a significant role in the history of Japan, serving not only as a military base during wars, but also a center of political power for feudal lords. It is the largest castle in Japan and has a network of 83 rooms. Cherry blossom season is usually around late March to early April and marks the beginning of spring. The blooming differs region to region due to temperature, elevation, and varying types of cherry blossom tree. During this time, you'll see many people picnicking, taking pictures, and spending time with friends and family. So I went to the castle on Monday, and still there were surprisingly a lot of people. Expect to take over an hour to get through the main keep if the lines look like this. The castle had a unique feature called Hishinomon, which is a diamond-shaped opening in the roof of the castle's main keep. This was designed to help ventilate the castle and regulate temperature and humidity. But it also served a more secretive purpose where samurai guards could use the opening to secretly observe and monitor the movements of the people in the castle below. This also allowed them to quickly spot any potential security threats or suspicious activity. If you're planning to visit Himeji Castle during the winter or springtime, make sure to wear some socks. I saw some people barefoot and they look miserable. The castle floor gets really cold and your feet will be freezing especially if the line gets long and if you're just standing there absorbing all the coldness from the wood.
on top of the main keep, which is on the sixth floor, you can see a small shrine where you can make an offering. the entire day here because you could go picnic, spend some time visiting the castle, visit the zoo which is right next to the park, and wander in the garden. Also there are some stalls in front of the castle where you could just visit and get some food.